beauties so today we're going to be doing an unboxing and we're going to be actually doing an unboxing of not one not two but we're going to be doing an unboxing of three different boxy charms for the past three months so i believe they're august september and october so i have three of them i've been so behind on unboxing so hopefully you guys can join me today and what I'm going to be doing is instead of opening the boxes up like this, I'm actually going to flip the camera over so you guys can have a better view of what's in the boxes. And I'm actually going to go in no particular order. I don't know which box is which month, so we're kind of going to start at a random box and just open it and kind of keep going. So let's jump into the video. Happy Sunday, you guys. Hopefully you guys are doing great. I actually just ordered my Halloween costume yesterday, last night. And and so I am so excited to share it with you guys once it comes in, probably around next weekend most likely. And so let's get into the three boxy charm unboxings. All right, you guys, so like I mentioned, I'm not sure which box is which month, but I'm just going to start with this first one right here, and let's go ahead and see what's inside. Here's um, a little card. It says Spellbound Boxy Charm. It has all the different items listed with the prices on the back. Now, let's go ahead and see what's in this month's um, Boxy Charm. Okay, so I believe this is October's Boxy Charm because I have seen a couple of previews. So this first item is Dr. Brandt's Pore Perfecting Exfoliator, and I am really excited to use this brand. I've only used maybe like one other thing from this brand, and everyone seems to be loving it, so I'm really excited to check this out. Um, Becca Highlight, oh my gosh, I've seen this actually in one of the other YouTubers' unboxings, and this is awesome. This highlighter alone, I think is like 40 bucks. Um, yeah, 38 dollars my favorite high-end highlighter is actually from becca it's um in the shade opal but i've also tried you know the ones um by jacqueline hill and this is in the shade prosecco pop so let's go ahead and swatch it's a really nice kind of champagne of a goldy toned of a highlight that's really beautiful i am so excited that this is actually in our boxy charm because that's a great value on its own and then let's go ahead and see what's the next thing it's um jean de bleu that's a really cool name kind of seems super frenchy and this is a lip liner Ooh, it seems really smooth that's really cool i'm excited to use this and this is like a really nice kind of neutral shade of a of a lip pencil so that's always awesome now next thing is dirty little secret let's open it this is let's see this is an eyeshadow crayon okay um i don't really use a lot of eyeshadow crayons Ooh, but this is so beautiful and super pearly can you guys see that i don't know if you guys it's like a really pearly um opalescent kind of i don't know really nice shade and can you guys see when i go over it it kind of changes so it's kind of like a not a dual chrome but it's really kind of cool of a texture so that will probably be put to use for sure now let's go ahead and see the last thing in here is by tarte it's a lip paint tartist let's go ahead and open and this is in the shade bestie so let me see and I feel like this is its full size, maybe. Ooh, this is a beautiful shade. Um, let me go ahead and swatch it for you guys. So this is in the shade Bestie. Ooh, I feel like this lip crayon and the actual lip paint are going to go great together. That's awesome. All right. So for this month's box, I'm really kind of shocked and surprised. I really enjoy every single item. In this box from the eyeshadow stick to the actual lip paint and the lip pencil and of course the highlight that was awesome so let me move this aside and all these things aside to the left right here and then let's go ahead and open the next box so this is either August or September's box so this one is a boxy baddie. I think that's what it says. Um, it also has all the items listed. And I have also seen spoilers for this one, but I'm just really excited. This is a pure um, 
eyeshadow palette i'm assuming yes oh my goodness i'm so excited for this i'm actually not going to swatch this because i am thinking of including it in a giveaway so this is what all the shades are there's two rows of mattes one row of shimmers but they seem really beautiful and very really nice kind of you know everyday colors so i'm actually not going to touch this and i'm going to probably include it in a giveaway for you guys um, next thing in here is a Brio Geo Don't Despair Repair Deep Conditioning Mask. Ooh, that's awesome. I actually had a heat protectant from Brio Geo, like a little mini sample size, and I didn't really like it because it had like a really weird scent to it, but I'm excited to try the conditioning mask. Now, next thing in here is a Studio Makeup um hd finishing powder okay you can never have too many of these i feel like if you get like subscriptions and a boxy charm especially you get so much really nice makeup where you can actually like utilize it on a day-to-day -day basis where you don't need to buy any extra makeup and so this is really nice it says a silky setting powder with light shimmer to help blur appearance of imperfections and pores i don't know about the shimmer um but i do like a really nice powder i don't think you can see the shimmers but i'm not gonna open it i'm gonna kind of keep it closed just because i have a few powders that i'm using at the moment next two things are eye brushes which is really cool one is an angled liner the other one is a body yography pro um, that's awesome because you can never have too many angled brushes. I don't think you can have ever too many brushes, period, because you can go longer without, you know, washing them and cycling them through. Now, this next thing in here is a, no way, there's a MAC eyebrow pencil crayon. That is so cool. It's like a miniature, um, brow filler. That is so cool. I've never had a MAC brow pencil or product so that seems actually super smooth um and it's not too soft but it's not too harsh either so that is awesome it kind of seems like my shade maybe it's a little too dark of a tone but that is so cool that that's in here and then last thing in here is an ultra satin lip by ColourPop in the shade Where the, where's the shade oh there we go strut all right let me go ahead and swatch this one for you guys it's a it's a um, um, satin finish so it's kind of more creamy and I feel like it dries down almost matte but not completely and that is another beautiful beautiful shade as you guys can see the other um, Tarte lip paint is a little bit more on the drier side because it is completely matte so we have one matte one satin one lip pencil and that is great all right so this one I'm gonna scoot away and I'm actually I should actually calculate the values of these so this box total is around $130, which is awesome, amazing. Now let me calculate this one, the one we just opened, the first box, let's see. And this one is around 120 of a value, so that is awesome. And so let's go ahead and jump into the last box. This one is actually the most packed because it has it's almost like bulging. And so let's open it. Oh, this is I think August's box. I think this is the first box I received. And this total value of the box is around 125 or something close to that so they're all over a hundred dollars worth of value so let's go ahead and see the first thing in here that is drawing me in are some pure lashes which i'm really excited about because i don't have like a ton of lashes i don't really wear them often unless like it's a special occasion so these seem really kind of um natural of a finish so that's awesome next thing in here is the tarte rainforest of the sea volume 2 eyeshadow palette look at that you guys like that is such a great value on its own like that is amazing let's go ahead and open it oh my gosh the packaging tart has the cutest packaging this is so adorable and this is what it looks like um also like a very neutral type of palette and once again i'm not going to swatch this one because i am going to include it in a giveaway so i'll keep it closed 
And I really do enjoy Tarte Cosmetics um, eyeshadow formula for the most part, especially on the bigger palettes. So I'm super excited that that's in here. Now, next thing in here is a set of brushes by Moda Pro. That is so cool. I cannot wait to use these because they seem really, really soft. Let's open it. So there's three different brushes. There's a pointed blush brush. There's a chisel, probably for like contour brush. And then there's also a crease brush. Nice. Okay, let's go ahead and take these out. Oh my gosh, this is so soft. It kind of reminds me of the Kat Von D um, brushes because they kind of have this kind of colored. And there's some that are, have this shape as well. That's really cool. And it has a... Um, really nice kind of rubbery tip and handle. Wow, these are so soft. I'm really excited. And so is this one. But this one is more for like contouring maybe. It's a little bit more of a dense brush. That's always great. Alright, next thing in here is a gel eyeliner. And this is in black. But it's unfortunately... Oh my gosh, I didn't even realize you guys couldn't see. Um, it's not automatic, so you guys do have to sharpen them. It seems really creamy and very matte, so that's always nice in an actual gel pencil. Next thing in here is a face paint lip and cheek tint. This is what it looks like. Um, I... I'm not a huge fan of creams on your cheeks, so I'm not going to swatch this, even though I was about to, um, because I'll include it in a giveaway as well. Um, I do like my powders, so that is probably not going to have a lot of use in my um, collection, so I am going to probably give it away. And then there's also a $10 off, orders over 60 and more for Tarte, and this actually is expired already. All right, well, that's trash and then there's also a win two hundred dollars in the free products follow us from aloette and even though i am going to be giving some of these things away or including them in a giveaway for you guys i have a lot left to put to use and test out so for me two thumbs up i really did enjoy everything that came in these um, months the past three months worth of boxy charms so thank you guys for watching all right hopefully you guys enjoyed the video um if you guys actually like this setup where i flip the camera over do let me know because i'm thinking of doing a few more videos like this a declutter of my ipsy makeup bags a declutter of some eyeshadow palettes of mine and i'm thinking of doing them this style of a video where i flip the camera around so you have less me and more of what's going on a little bit of a closer zoom so if you did like this video this way give this video a thumbs up so i know and hopefully you guys have a wonderful week i will see you guys soon lots of love for me to you stay happy stay positive and i'll talk to you guys in my next video bye Mwah.